Hey everyone, what's up? It's Lauren Carr, which is Vegan In, where in each episode we try to look at a different aspect of the vegan lifestyle, and I am still in bed, but I will be getting out, <laughs> and we are going to do a What I Eat in a Day video, and if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe, because believe me, you do not want to be missing out on these good times. So while I was lounging here, I was just kind of laughing because I have so much Puggle stuff in my room. I just wanted to show you a few things. Now, I think some of you know that my Puggle Berkeley lives with my mom in the States, but I miss her, miss her so dearly because with my work schedule and I travel a lot that it's just kind of better for her to stay with my mom who can provide, you know, just more consistency for her. But anyway, she's like my soulmate and I miss her. Anyway, I want to show you some of the stuff I have. <laughs> Most mornings I just have a banana and it's because I'm up early training clients, but today and due to self-isolation, my schedule's changed a little bit, so I thought we'd have some potato waffles. So I'm gonna pop these into the toaster, put a little butter, maybe a little maple syrup, why not? Let's treat ourselves. I got a busy day ahead, so I need some fuel in me. Let's get to eating these. All right, so as I'm eating this, you know what this reminds me of? Because it's made from potatoes, it's kind of like that hash brownie-ish kind of feel, and then you put the maple syrup on, mm-mm-mm, yum. We are back in the kitchen, and it's time for Lunchkins, woo, yes. I know, a little too much energy. <laughs> I just came back from a run, and before that, I filmed one of my weekly workout videos, which I'm posting here on this channel every Wednesday for a Workout Wednesday. Just because we're all self-isolating, I wanted to create these indoor workouts to help everyone stay sane during this time, so please feel free to check those out. But right now, I'm starving, so what I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have a salad. Now, I'm making it a little bit interesting because I'm adding some baked beans to it. I'm just working for what I have in the cabinet because I know it's not so easy easy to run to the grocery stores these days and it actually does taste really really good so what we're gonna do we're gonna add some lettuce some baked beans some tomato salsa some sweet corn and oh yes an avocado mm -mm -mm. getting a bit of protein in there anyway I'm starving I need to feed this face let's get eating mm -mm -mm. so much goodness Ooh, the baked beans mm. So much nutrients going on in here. And guys, I'm not even gonna lie, even when we're not self-isolating, I still like to throw baked beans in here. I don't know. I've been living in England way too long. We throw baked beans on everything. I just finished a close-up magic session because that's something I'm working on while I'm in self-isolation. I think some of you know that I'm a cabaret performer who always uses stage magic in the cabaret and with the characters that I create to help tell the story. So I'm working on a little close-up. Anyway, I am hungry. It is dinner time. Oh my gosh, but I have to admit, I am loving that the sun is still out. I love the long summer nights. We have made it through the winter, yes. Oh my gosh, it makes me so happy. I'm like such a sun baby. Love it. Anyway, on to what we're eating. So what I'm gonna have for dinner it is quick, easy, simple. You know that's how I like to roll. And it just needs three ingredients, cauliflower, rice, lentils, and tomato sauce. Now I bought little packets of cauliflower, rice, and lentils just because it stores longer in the cupboard and during these times of like self-isolation and lockdown, it's good to have. Literally what I am doing, I'm taking the cauliflower, rice, the lentils, throwing it in into a pot, throwing some of the tomato sauce on top and heating it up and eating it. Quick, easy, simple, delicious and nutritious. Yes. Team, this has become a staple meal for me. I mean, it takes like less than five minutes to make when it's really delicious, when, and it's low in calories, win, win, win. Oh my gosh. Anyway, really, really good and the amount that I made makes enough for like at least two servings or two meals, so that's always good as well. Thank you so much for joining me and seeing what I eat in a day. I hope you all are doing well, staying safe, staying sane, and thank you so much for watching. And please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to Just Veganin and follow me on Instagram at Just Veganin. Win, win, win. Oh my gosh.